Hey guys, this is going to this is iTech Plus or Joe here, and today I'm showing you how to get free in-app purchases of iOS 6. There was a previous app called iApp Cracker, but that no longer works with iOS 6. I don't know why. Maybe they stopped updating it and developing it. I'm not sure. But yeah, this uh, if you know what in-app purchase, I'm pretty sure you should know what in-app purchase games such as I know like Temple Run. I uh, can't really think of any other ones. I don't. I don't play that many games on my iDevice. But like Temple Run, if you want to buy coins in game, it costs real life money, so pounds or dollars. Uh, with this, you can click away and buy as many in-app purchases as you want for completely free. Um, so, yeah, this is in a way, this is, you could say this is an alternative for iOS 6, but I guess. There was another one, it was called iApp Free. That didn't work for me, but I'm not sure why, but here's one that works and it's guaranteed to work, and today I'll be showing you how to do it. So, you, you, uh, you're going to need a jailbroken device, head over to Cydia, and you want to add the following source. So, you just go Manage, Sources then edit and add and you're going to want to add the following source it's called <coughs> system.in-appstore.com forward slash repo if you can't read that it will be in the description and they'll probably text on the screen now so once you've added that source wait for it to install and once you've done that so click on the source and there is only one thing in there that is local iApp store and then the same procedure as you normally would install it Confirm. It's a couple of kilobytes, so it doesn't really take up anything whatsoever. And I'm pretty sure you will have to respring your device once it is finished. Yep, restart Springboard, and then wait for this. So yeah, this is completely free. It doesn't take anything out of your. I guess if you've got um, what they called the iTunes vouchers on your account, it won't take it out of that. If you've got linked up with your bank, it won't take it out of that. It's it does it for completely free. It's pretty useful, really. So yeah, once your device has respringed, unlock settings. And by the way, if you're wondering what the theme's called, I'm going to do a video on that soon. It's quite a popular theme, it's called Icon or Acon, depending on how you pronounce it. Oh, so yeah, once uh, that's all it up, go to your settings and then scroll down to your jailbreak section. And you should see the local iApp store. Click on that. And on yours, these will all be disabled probably simply enable, I guess you can enable both of them uh, obviously as it says there, generate custom receipt only works on iOS 6 plus I just went ahead and did that, I, did not, I don't really have a clue what it does but I just enable both of them, so yeah remember to enable both of them in order for this to work then head over to the app that you want to uh, get your free and app purchase I'm not sure what it's compatible with but I'm just going to use Temple Run as an example uh, it works with Temple Run 1 and 2 I'm not, not really sure, like I said I don't play that many games I have to try it out on my iPhone. Turn it down a minute. Oh, cancel. Um, add the volume. There it is. Okay, then head over to the store and click Get More Coins. Wait for this all to load up. Um, so let's say you want two hundred thousand coins. You click it. Uh, the little thing will come up saying um, this click cancel and if done correctly there you go you should have your whatever you've bought for it could be coins upgrades or whatever so you can do this simply click on it it will come up saying are you sure you want to buy this click cancel and it will add it to your whatever you're doing so yeah thanks for watching I hope this helped it's certainly certainly very useful because who, who is you're getting stuff for free so yeah thanks for watching remember to comment rate, subscribe